please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. I'm Ezra Heckman, and I'm your student body president. And my name is Cameron Cox, one of your 7th grade reps. Please check the lost and found table outside the office. These items will be taken away at the end of the month. We have a, we have a special guest with us today, Ellie Robinson, to make an announcement for the dance company. Welcome to the green, green room, Ellie. Hey guys, I'm here to tell you that Dance Co. tryouts are tomorrow from 3 to 4 and Friday from 12.50 to 3. Both days are required. Make sure you bring lots of snacks. Dance Co. is lots of fun and we'd love to see you there. Wrestling fact number six. Did you know that girls can compete on the wrestling team? In fact, some of our toughest, toughest weights have, have some very athletic girls in them. Girls make good wrestlers because they are smart, flexible, flexible, and can leverage their bodies differently than boys. Girls, please come to join join the wrestling team. Wrestling will start today at 3 p.m. See you there. And now for our College of the Month video. I was born and raised in Venezuela. My parents, they went to school. My mom was a dentist and my dad's an industrial engineer. When I was 14, there were some economic issues in the country and my parents realized that we would have better opportunities and a better future if we moved to America. Since the beginning of my technical career, I always asked each of the professors that I was with which university had the best biotechnology program in and out of state. And it always came back to UVU. It always came back to the great program that they have in here and all of the many opportunities that are given to the students. Right now I'm working on a behavioral experiment with fish. I think can really help us all to understand the way that humans act as well. UVU has helped me improve myself in a lot of different ways. I feel like I have a stronger level of confidence and self-esteem because of it. I feel like I'm more prepared for the future now. My name is Daniela Godoy, and I'm studying biotechnology at Utah Valley University, and I want to become a criminologist. And now for the Student of the Month presentation. Einer, and I'm here to announce the students of the month for the month of February. So our first student of the month is Lauren McMaster. And Lauren was, um, was uh, nominated by her teachers as someone who takes risks, is attentive, and is a hard worker. So congratulations, Lauren. Um, what I wanted you to tell me about your pets. Um, I have three cats, a Siamese, two tabbies, and a dog. Wow, that's a lot of pets. Congratulations. I hope you have a really fun time at Student of the Month. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, our next student of the month is sixth grader Soren Lowry. So Soren, come on down. Soren's teachers say that he is empathetic, humble, positive, and makes great contributions to class. So Soren, tell me about what you like to do on the weekends. I like to ski and sleep over the weekends. Okay, good. That sounds like a great plan, mm -hmm. uh, great, great things to do. Okay, congratulations, Soren. Okay, our next um, student of the month is seventh grader Olivia Call. Olivia's teachers say that she is mature, friendly, and a deep thinker. And so, Olivia, what's your favorite class at school? Um, I really like English and French. Okay, awesome. Good job. Um, I hope you have a great time at Student of the Month. The next Student of the Month is Alex. Um, Alex Camacho. Alex, come on down. Alex's teachers say that he is quiet, respectful, and very hardworking. So, Alex... What kinds of movies do you like to watch? Oh, I like to watch action and sci-fi movies. Okay, do you have anything in particular that you... Uh, like Marvel and uh, like Kung Fu. Cool. Well, congratulations. Well, I hope you have fun at Cafe Rio. Okay, our next student of the month is 8th grader Bailey Burbage. Bailey's uh, teachers say that um, she's an excellent student who's respectful and hardworking. So, Bailey, I want you to tell me about your, your pets. Um, well, I have one ferret a crested gecko, and two dogs. One of them's a Rhododendron Ridgeback, and the other one's a lab, 
and Bloodhound next year. Okay, that's very cool. I see Bailey walking the neighborhood with her ferret, and that is pretty fun to, mm -hmm. to see. Okay, congratulations, Bailey. Thanks. And our last student of the month is Jeremy Solorzano. Jeremy's teachers say that he is always prepared, does high quality work, and uses his time wisely. That's awesome. So, Jeremy, what's your favorite class at school? Uh, my favorite class is band, just because Mr. Featherstone is a really good teacher, and I like the way he teaches. Yeah, Mr. Featherstone's awesome. Um, I hope you have congratulations and have fun at Cafe Rio. Thank you so much, and congratulations to all of these students of the month. Bye. Thanks for being here. Have a Wednesday, Wasatch. <laughs>